here with our second episode of our Pokemon Diamond Randomizer Nuzlocke Let's Play. And uh, if you guys are absolutely excited for the next episode in this adventure, please go leave a like down below. Uh, as well as comment, let me know what you think after the video, so, uh, cause obviously you don't know how you like the video, uh, now, but anyway, this episode, we are choosing our starter, and, uh, in the last episode, I did ask you guys to let me know what starter, uh, starter you would like to see, and our choices were the Aura Pokemon Lucario, the, uh, Wicked Pokemon Shiftry, and then our Spitfire Pokemon Magmar, and, uh, I looked at all the comments, uh, all of you guys, a lot of you, a freaking lot of you guys voted, um, and the last place was, of course, Shiftry, unfortunately. I really would have liked to see Shiftry, uh, but that quad weakness, like, Bug, for example, that would have been kind of booty, um, and also you guys said the level up moveset wasn't good either, so Shiftry was dead last, and our second runner-up was Magmar, and I'm not gonna lie, guys, um, I wanted to see Magmar. I wanted to, to see Magmar go. I wanted to see freaking Tit Duck put in all the work because I freaking love fire types, but you guys chose Lucario. So we're gonna choose the Aura Pokemon Lucario to start off this Let's Play. Uh, so we are rocking with a fully evolved freaking Lucario, guys, and I'm ecstatic. We're gonna go against this Starly here. Uh, go Lucario, not even bad. Alrighty, so we're going to, uh, we're going, okay, so this thing has Quick Attack, Foresight, Metal Claw, and Detect. Uh, let me, let me see, let me see how much Metal Claw does. I wonder what nature this thing is. I cannot wait to see what nature this thing is, uh, and, uh, see what this thing can do. So, we're gonna one-shot the Starly, not even bad. Lucario's too OP, man. Lucario's too OP. The Wild Starly fainted. We gained 16 experience. Yeah, we're not gonna, we're not gonna level up. Uh, what was Ming Li's voice? Oh my goodness, it's been a hot minute. Wow, your Pokemon totally rocked, but mine was way tougher than yours. They were other people's Pokemon, though. We had to use them. They won't mind, will they? Oh, it's, uh, what's-his-face? Don't even- Lucas, that's what it is. Whoa, you found the briefcase? The professor would have gone through the roof if he knew I'd forgot it here. Huh? What? Did you guys- Did you use those Pokemon? Oh man, how am I gonna explain this to the professor? This briefcase is the professor, so I'll take it, okay? Aw. That makes me sad. <laughs> what, what was that about? I don't know what's going on, Moxie. Let's get out of here. My Pokemon got hurt from that uh, from that battle. If we get attacked by another Pokemon, we might be in trouble. Shoot, Lucario didn't take a single bit of damage because Lucario is a boss. I'm really happy with that choice, guys. I, I know Lucario's pretty prevalent in a lot of Let's Plays, but I, I mean, come on. Lucario, it was introduced in this gen. Like, it, it, I think it's pretty fitting. Go ahead. I knew... Uh, wait, I know we have to go return those Pokemon, they're not ours, but I want to spend just a little bit more time with this little guy. Oh, that makes me sad. It's okay, little guy. I, I think, I think I know what's, uh, what's about to happen here. Alrighty, so they're just waiting for us. Hey, it's those people. Is that old guy staring at us? Hmm, I heard from Lucas that you used our Pokemon. Let me see them, please. Hmm, Lucario and Turtwig. Wait, so, wait, did it actually say Lucario, but it kept Turtwig for him? That's really weird. Wait, Turtwig? Wait, okay, I'm so confused. I see, that's how it is. Lucas, I'm going back to my lab. Alrighty. Uh, yeah, of course, Professor, wait for me. You should visit uh, us at our lab, I think. We'll be seeing you. I can't read, guys. What was that about craziness about? I mean, if he was angry, he would have just yelled at us or whatever, but he didn't- Wait, and he didn't want their Pokemon back? Moxie, we should go home too. Wait, so are we going- Oh, we're- Okay, we're just gonna teleport home. Alrighty. Alrighty. Hey, Mama, what's for dinner? What's up? Alrighty. What's up, dear? Wow, I can't believe that happened to you. Am I ever glad that both you and Mingli were un unharmed? The perfect- <laughs> Woo! Let's read today. Uh, the professor you mentioned is most likely Professor Rowan of Sand Gym Town. Sand Gym. Sand Gym. I've heard that uh, he is well known for his studies on Pokemon. I hear he's also quite intimidating. Moxie, I think you need to visit him in Sand Gym Town. You need to properly explain why, uh, why you had no choice but to use his Pokemon. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll understand. Oh, I know. Moxie, put these on. 
Moxie received a pair of running shoes. I was waiting. I did not know when, when uh, we were going to get those. I was waiting for those. Uh, going to Sand Gem Town is like an adventure in itself, right? With those running shoes, you can get to faraway places much faster. Okay, let me read the... Okay. All right, B button. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Yep. Awesome. Great. You know, that's... Isn't that just... Okay. Alrighty. All right. So, hey, we can run now. Uh, do I need to get Mingli? Nah, you know what? Mingli is just gonna stay behind. Alright guys, so this is a Nuzlocke and we are on a new route. However, we have not received Pokeballs yet. So, um, the lock has technically not started, but we're still gonna try not to faint. And, uh, let me see, let me scout out what's on this route. Okay, please do not give me a freaking, uh, Krikatot. Please, 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 for the love of Pokemon, just don't give me a Krikatot. Please. Uh, all right, so we're going to Metal Claw. Sure. Doesn't Metal Claw have like low? Uh, okay, you're. A pr um, please don't bite me, please. Please, I would appreciate it. Just so you guys know, uh, when the first episode came out, uh, Pokemon claimed me twice within ten minutes of having the intro uh, of the game, and it said that the music was copyright. And I was thinking, there's so many Let's Plays of Diamond here on YouTube, and they've never been claimed. And then 7th Gen is coming out, and, uh, you know, the last remakes there were were, uh, was, uh, 3rd Gen. So I'm thinking, hmm, does this mean that a, uh, a 4th Gen remake is on the way? I don't know. I'm excited. I just wanted to throw that at you guys. Uh, I'll make, you know what? Question of the day. Uh, what, um... If there is a fourth gen remake, what would you guys like to see? Like what like what do you expect from the game? Like what would you want to be added? What like maybe the newer features in like sixth gen, like would you want those to be added? Uh, let me know guys. And by the way, uh, how I'm gonna be naming Pokemon in this series is uh, I'm gonna be looking at the comments section uh, to see who answered the question of the day or who commented or whatever and I'm gonna pick you guys uh, To name these mons. That's pretty exciting. So I, you guys get to join me on this adventure. So Hi, I've been waiting for you. Please come with me. The professor's waiting to see you the profs the profs waiting to see you See this is our Pokemon research lab. We'll just go ahead and oh Mingli was already here apparently Forever running into me. What the oh, it's you moxie. That old guy, he's not so scary. Uh, no, he's not scary so much as he is totally out there. <laughs> oh, it doesn't matter, Moxie. I'm out of here. See you later. What was that? Your friend always seems to be in such a rush. Anyway, let's go in. Alrighty. Alright, let's see what the prof wants. This music, though. I don't think I randomized the music uh, in this game, but this is really nice. Finally, you come. Moxie, was it? Let me see your Pokemon again. Well, well, you've made your Pokemon evolve already? <laughs> Totes, definitely. Alrighty then, I'll give you that Lucario, uh, that Lucario to you as a gift. Now it's yours. Would you like to give it a nickname? Yes, so, so, so many of you guys wanted me to name this Lucario Luke. And you know what? He did answer the question, uh, which starter, and he wanted the Lucario, and you guys wanted me to name it Luke, so you know what? We're, we're gonna rock out with Lucario. <laughs> it's so stupid. Hmm, okay, I see. And you're happy with that nickname? Yes. Your friend Mingli told me what happened at the lake. I heard you battled very well, despite it being your first time. And from what I can see, there is a growing bond between you and that Pokemon, though it is still young. That's why I would like to entrust you with Lucario. Boy, am I glad you're kind towards Pokemon. If you weren't, well, I don't even want to think about it. Well, we got Lu Lucario. <laughs> Let's move on to the main topic. There's something I want you to do for me. My name is Rowan. I study Pokemon. First of all, I want you to know exactly what kind of Pokemon live in the Sinnoh region. To do so, it is necessary to collect data using the Pokédex. This is what I wish uh, what I wish to ask of you. I want to entrust you with this Pokédex. Will you use it to record da uh, data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? Yes. Hmm. Good answer. Moxie obtained the Pokédex. Not even bad. That Pokédex is very a uh, very high-tech device. It will automatically record data on every kind of Pokemon you encounter. Moxie, I ask that you go everywhere and meet every kind of Pokemon in this region. Too bad this is a lock. I've got the same kind of Pokédex as you. 
When you walked up Route 201 with your Pokemon, what did you feel? I've lived for 60 long years. Even now, I get a thrill when I'm with a Pokemon. Now, you should know that there are countless Pokemon in this world. That means there are just as many thrills waiting for you out there. Now go! Moxie, your grand adventure begins right now. The professor asked me to help, so I'm going to go and fill the Pokedex pages, too. That makes us comrades working together. I'll teach you stuff later, okay? All right, thanks, Lucas. Thanks. Wait, Lucas? Luke, are you? Luke? There's, there's too much going on here, guys. I'm not okay. All right, guys. So we have not gotten our Pokeballs yet. Hey, Moxie, I want to show you a few things, so follow me. Oh, wait, is this... Is this... Is this the time? This building with the red roof is the Pokemon Center. You can get your Pokemon healed if it's been, uh, if it's been hurt in battle. You'll find a Pokemon Center in most towns. Over here, the building with the blue roof is the Pokemart. It's a shop where you can buy and sell all sorts of items. Moxie, since you're a rookie trainer, you won't be able to buy very much stuff. Don't worry about it, okay? Oh yeah, right, Moxie. You should let your family know you're helping Professor Rowan put together his Pokedex. Sometimes, you have to go far away, so you should let someone know. But first, go heal up your Pokemon at the Poke Center. You'll be safe then. Okay, I'll be seeing ya. No Pokeballs yet. Hmm... I don't know when we get those. Uh, I can check to see if I have money and we can go to the Pokemart and see if we can buy some balls. Yes, heal me up. For heal me up, Nurse Joy. All right, I'm so excited guys. Lucario is gonna put in all the work and uh, it's gonna be exciting. Talk to that nice lady at the counter. Okay, all right. All right, thanks for the tutorial guys. I was expecting some gifts, but I guess it is technically the first town, so I can't expect too much, I guess. Alright, we're gonna go home and see Mama. Let her know that her 10-year-old daughter is leaving for uh, an adventure with a scary, powerful monster. <laughs> oh, we get a Carvana? Not even bad. That would actually compliment Lucario pretty well. I know Carvana's not, like, super, uh, like, bulky. It really can't take hits, but, like, uh, it could take a fire type hit. Uh, so that'd be kind of cool. Two Mons weak to fighting, though. That's... Alright, we're gonna quick attack you. How much is quick attack? Oh, okay, almost. Okay, rough skin. That's fine. Alrighty. You're gonna leer me. Mistakes were made! Alright. Are you gonna Aqua Jet me or something? <laughs> I don't even think it gets Aqua Jet. GG. All right, so Car Carvana's going down, so it's kind of nice to see what possibilities there are in this first route. So we've seen uh, Krikatot and Carvana. That's not too bad. And we're gonna level up to level six. So we do have to be careful. Lucario is very strong, so uh, I don't want to overlevel and not be able to hit anything. Counter? Uh, what do we have again? You know, what? I'll get rid of Foresight. Uh, I don't really see any use for it, to be honest. Wait, wouldn't Foresight allow me to hit ghost types? You know what? Whatever. It's okay. It's all good. <laughs> Alright, Mama. Come. Come here. Alright, so we're gonna go home. Our home is down here. I'm so used to, like, your house being in the top left. I feel like that's a, a pretty big difference in this game. Come here. Let me uh, get in front of your TV. Welcome home, Moxie. Are you and your Pokemon healthy? Take a quick rest, dear. What's up, Mo uh, wow, Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big? Okay, dear, go for it. Your mom's got your back. Aw, mom's got us beat. Oh, I know, Moxie. I've got something that you'll find useful. We obtained the journal. Uh, if that's a journal, it keeps a record of your daily events. Check it, and you'll be able to remember what you did last. Gee, a journey full of adventure. I envy you, kiddo. Plus, you're not alone. You have your Pokemon with you. I wish I could go instead. I'm just joking, dear. Yep, Moxie, I'll be all right by myself. So you go and enjoy your adventure. When you're exposed to new things, experience new sensations, it makes your mother happy, too. But come back sometime. I would like to see the kinds of Pokemon you caught, dear. Oh, she's such a sweet... I love the mom in this game. Uh, excuse me, is my little Mingly here? She gets a really annoying voice, just like Mingly. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, then he must have left already. What to do? That boy shouted about going on an adventure, then he bolted. He's so headstrong and reckless. I at least wanted to take uh, him to have this. Not to worry, Mo uh, Moxie will deliver that to him. Won't you, Moxie? Oh, why are... Mom, Mom, I liked you. St don't make me do this. Oh, really? You do that for me? Moxie, please take this for me. Uh, to Mingli for me. The parcel. Not even bad. So we have to bring the parcel to Mingli. Let me think. Knowing my boy, he would have probably headed straight to Jubilife City. Okay, please take that to Mingli. 
All right, you're welcome. All right, see ya, mom. Love you. Thanks for everything, you sweet soul, you. All right, so we don't have balls yet, I don't think. I'm pretty sure we do not. So, all right. So we're gonna find Mingli, I guess, and then wait to get balls. I don't know. Speaking of ghost types, oh, we have Metal Claw though. Okay, so there's a there's Dusk Nor in this grass as well. Uh, alrighty, well there's that. All right, so this probably is not gonna do too much because Dusk Nor is like relatively bulky. I'm pretty sure. Oh, don't bind me. Uh, so this Dusknor, since it's a fully evolved Pokemon, should honestly give us some, like, decent experience. So that's why I'm taking time on this. Otherwise, I probably would skip, um... That tech speed is so slow. I'm gonna have to change that. <laughs> Sweet! Okay, so I think I'm thinking of, um... What's that, uh... Steel type move that has like pretty low accuracy that like misses. Am I thinking of metal? No. I can't even think of it, but it looks like Metal Claw has like decent accuracy, which kind of worried me when I saw Metal Claw. I was like, oh, is that that like low accuracy steel type move? But it's looking good. So we already have a freaking stab on our Lucario, so that's pretty nice. Um, let me see here. Let's see if I can buy balls yet. I'm pretty sure they're gonna gift it to us, so. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. We're gonna buy. We can buy Pokeballs! Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna buy six. It's an even number, so it's not too bad. And then I'm gonna buy um, potions as well. Because you can never have too many potions. We're gonna buy six, and we're gonna be flat broke. Um, so yeah, the lock has officially started guys. I guess this is like one of the only games where they don't gift you pokeballs at the beginning You actually have to buy them yourself. So let me heal up Lucario real quick and then we can see What we get what we're gonna get So we've seen Krikatot, Carvana, and Dusknor. I have honestly probably wouldn't mind um, Dusknor out of all of those just because uh, that's a fighting resistance. I mean, obviously it's immune to fighting types. So that'd be pretty cool. Uh, so Luca and it's pretty bulky. I, I really like bulky mons in Let's Plays just because, I mean, obviously less deaths. Woo! Or that, at least that's the thought anyway. Okay, so this is our, uh, first round encounter. And it is a dust form! Yes, okay. Yes, please. Come here. Come here. Uh, this thing is probably gonna be kind of hard to catch, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, probably should have bought more than six Pokeballs. Uh. Alright, so we're gonna use Metal Claw. Should not kill, because it didn't kill last time. Sweet, it's in the red, so that's perfect. It's gonna bind me, that's fine. That is A-OK -okay by me. Okay, alright. The animations are so slow on this game, which is fine. We're just hanging out, guys. It is no big deal. You know what? I didn't even see, uh, we didn't even get to see what this, bruh, your special attack and your attack is, uh, and it has inner focus. Not even bad. Okay, so we're going, uh, we're gonna go, no. So we're gonna go to our bag, and we're going to throw a Pokeball at it. I'm hoping since it's in red, I know it's a fully evolved Pokemon, it's a freaking Dusknor, but it's level two, it's down into the red. And it's gonna shake one time. Oh no, guys, this does not look good. This does not look good at all. Stop. Okay, so it's gonna leer me. That's fine. Maybe it's not okay. Please don't hurt me. Um, you're gonna continue to bind me. That's fine. Okay, so we're going to throw another ball at it. We really can't do anything else to this. Like, we have no other moves, nothing. We have no, no way to put it to sleep. So I'm hoping this is gonna be enough. You're in the red, dude. Come on, please. I would love a Dusknor. Twice? Three times? We got the Dusknor! Yes! I'm so excited. Okay, so Dusknor was caught. And it's female. Dusknor's data was added to the Pokedex. The antenna on its head captures radio waves from the world of spirits that command it to take people there. I Okay, I that's, that's new. I did not know that. All right, guys, so I'm going to look 
through the last episode and find a female name for Dusknor. Um, let me see. Hmm, what what's a good Dusknor name? All right, I don't know if it's a female name, but I like it for a Dusknor. Um, so Madara MLG uh, answered Lucario as the Mon they wanted to see, and I really like that name. So we're gonna name it Madara. Ma Madara. Okay. Sweet. So Madara, you are officially a Dusknor in our Let's Play Madara. Sweet. I'm excited. So we now have a Dusknor on the team. So Lucario and Dusknor. Not even bad. Alrighty. I didn't even check. Let me see. What does Dusknor have? Let me see. I'm not gonna switch. Uh, we're gonna hit check moves. Bind, leer, disable, nightshade. Eh, okay. And then summary as pressure. Uh, that's a fence though. So it's a fence and special defense and attack. Not even bad. All right, that's nice. That's actually really nice. All right, so we're gonna stay in here with Lucario and we're going to metal claw this thing. I was gonna say you outsped my Lucario. Okay, but no. I'm so glad we did not get a burn me. <laughs> I'm so sorry, burn me. As cute as you are, I do not want a trolley protecting burn me on my team. I'm so sorry. Oh, went for the double. Didn't even work though. All right, Lucario. Luke one shot this thing. And it's dead. Where's that bulk for me? Luke gained 17 experience. All right, so I'm gonna go and heal. Uh, we have our two encounters, and we can actually, what a lot of people forget about in this game is you can actually go back to that lake um, where we originally found the suitcase with uh, our starters in it, and we can actually get an encounter there as well. Um, the only thing is, is I don't have that many Pokeballs left, unfortunately, but uh, I'm hoping it'll be fine. We should be fine. I don't think I have enough for uh, more. All right, so we're gonna go to the lake and we're gonna see what we could get. Uh, so two encounters for the uh, second episode of the Let's Play. I'm super excited. So uh, we got a Route 201 encounter and we're gonna take the shortcut. We need about that life. All right, so dodge in the trees, Veri uh, Verity, Verity, uh, Lakefront. All right, Lake Verity. All right, so time to get our encounter for Lake Verity. Are you ready? I will take that slow, bro. Brahaley Incarnate. If you guys don't know, in my gold uh, Nuzlocke on Twitch, we had a slow bro named Haley. Rip Haley, a wheezing, freaking self-destructed on it, and it's gone. But we have a slow bro here, and I'm not gonna lie, guys, I'm probably gonna name it Haley. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Maybe not. It is female though, so it's like almost meant to be. <laughs> Are you gonna growl me? That's fine, that's fine. So my attack's gonna fall, so I can continue to metal claw this thing. Uh, even a crit won't uh, take it out, I'm pretty sure. I want a slow bro so bad. <sighs> it's just not meant to be. I'm not allowed to have nice things. <sighs> Rip Haley again. Oh my goodness. I'm so upset guys. What else could we have gotten? We missed out on a slow bro. Lucario, I'm too strong. Luke, what are you doing? Bra Scizor? Bro, this game is power. <laughs> Holy crap. I would have taken either. Oh my goodness. I'm sad. I'm like actually really sad. We could have had a slow bro on the team, but that's fine. You know, it's all good. Bra, the attack ro uh, rise, not even bad. Why did I have to mention crit? The moment I mentioned a crit, it was like, oh, did you say crit? I got you, Haley. Oh, it's a quick attacking scissor. 
I want it. All right, so we're gonna take the scissor out, get nice, uh, that nice experience. And uh, Lucario's kind of like a little, uh, it's, it's leveling up kind of a little too fast, a little bit faster than I wanted. Um, but, you know what, that's fine. Level 8, almost level 9. We have a level 2. <sighs> Why do you taunt me? Last patch of grass. I had one more step and then Slowbro was like, nope, I gotta shove it in your face. Alright, so uh, we're going to, um, we're gonna just run. We're getting a little over leveled and honestly Dusknor needs some experience. So, uh... I think we are uh, almost 30 minutes e uh, deep into this episode, so I think I'm going to call it a day. I'm pretty sure in the next episode we will be finding Ming Li and hopefully some more encounters. So again, guys, if you did enjoy this episode of the Diamond uh, Randomizer Nuzlocke, please leave a like down below, comment, and answer the question of the day. And uh, I will see you in the next video, Moxie Militia. Stay awesome. Bye.